And good morning, my love muffins. It is Tori, the hope dealer of Guided Intuitions, my sweet babies. And I am here with your daily guidance, your daily spiritual message, your daily reflection, depending on what part of the world you are and what time you are seeing this. But do not worry, because as we know, there are no timelines in the spirit realm. So whenever it is meant for you to receive this message, that is when it will show up in your life but when I am recording this is on this beautiful Tuesday honey like I am so excited for where we are going we have a new moon in Scorpio okay on the 7th and then Jupiter is coming home <laughs> depending on where you are it'll be on the 8th and the 9th just check your time zone all right but Jupiter is coming home all right so I just feel like this is a home coming this is a home coming do you feel it? Everything that we have been encountering and experiencing, okay? It's just so real. It's so raw and so real. This energy is so raw and so real. Like the veil is lifted, all right? It's not a question. There's no more confusion surrounding certain situations. Everything is clear. So you can definitely make the necessary decisions that you need to make on this beautiful Tuesday, November the 6th, 2018. However, if you're watching it another time, that's when it's meant for you, all right? So I hope my love muffins have took the time to meditate, okay? I pray that you have took the time to say some positive affirmations about your life and what you want. Make sure that you are feeding your spirit. I'm going to link below in the description box the video that I watched today by Lewis Hay surrounding 12... Um, 12 tools that she uses to love yourself more because self-love is so important guys self-love is what helps you thrive it's what it's what's helped you give you the courage to um you know just forward movement to do the things that you truly want to do all right self-love casts down fear and doubt <laughs> like oh my god i have never 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 said my affirmation i am happy and thankful that i now know myself love myself and accept myself wholeheartedly that affirmation is ringing so true to my life right now <laughs> and it's so much beauty look for the beauty in every lesson in every situation all right the time is now It's go time, all right? It's go time. Like, it's it's happening. It's real. <laughs> We're in the game, you know? So I hope that you have took the time to love on yourself. Make sure you do some mirror magic today. Make sure that you look in that mirror and you love on you, honey. You love on you. Make sure that you look at, stand in that mirror naked. No clothes. How you came in this world. <laughs> All right. And love on your body. Appreciate every mark, every crevice, every dot. All right. I want you just to um, appreciate the shape, the roll, honey, because I got me a love handle. You know, I want you to just love on you and just admire you for all that you are in your authentic truth. Look yourself in the eyes and tell yourself that there is no one in this whole world that you would rather be doing life with. That you chose you knowing everything that you chose this body and you chose this vessel. And I looked at myself and I had a conversation and I told myself it's okay I know you've been eating your um, nieces and nephews trick-or-treat candy and you've been tearing those Reese's up. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay, my love muffin. I'm going to go right in that kitchen and cook you up a beautiful salad that you've never tasted before. It's never going to taste anything you ever tasted before. You know, I have that conversation with myself because I started to beat myself up. And no, you're gorgeous. It's the way that you are. Like, I loved on myself. And I told myself, I'm so proud of you. Look at you, forward movement going on. Ah, oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. I'm so excited about where our life is headed. I'm so excited to be doing it with you, Latoria. Like there's nobody else, Tori, that I would want to do this with. I love you so much. Thank you for allowing me to love you in all of your authentic, beautiful truth.
all right? And make sure you have that conversation with yourself. Love on you, please. Love on this beautiful being and vessel that you are. I'm so utterly proud of every single one of you that are subscribed to my channel. Every single one of you that watch my daily guidance, guidance videos. Because let me tell you something, girl. I'm about to cry. I'm getting choked up, y'all. <laughs> I don't see 7,000 subscribers. I see 7,000 beautiful individuals that are choosing out of millions to love their self, to realize their worth and accept who they are because I know what I stand for. So if it's something in me that you see that draws you to me, I know what that is. And that's because you have made a vow to love yourself. You have made a vow to appreciate who you are. And that is fucking beautiful. That is so amazing in a world that tells us every day to be someone different, that you are finding the courage to be yourself. I'm so utterly proud of you and I apologize if you have not heard that enough but I am giving it to you on this day yes you you beautiful being pick your head up wipe those tears away because you are amazing and there is nothing that you cannot have you cannot do and you cannot be and we are going to figure this shit out together all right we are soul family we are tied in forever do you hear me? <laughs> so I want to let you guys know that I love you and I just wanted to love on you guys today. I wanted to love on you guys today because you are amazing. You are powerful. You are worth it and so much more. It is an honor to meet with you guys every day. I love every single one of you that hop in my inbox, that call my phone. I know I ain't been recalling returning calls yet please forgive me all right school this everything but i'm telling you i appreciate you i'm getting to my emails i'm getting them out honey <laughs> i love you guys just know that your girl is definitely working but i know that you guys know that you guys are some of the most patient sweet human beings ah i just love y'all all right i apologize my nieces and nephews are up for school so they are doing what they doing but I'm going to go ahead and move forth in this message today, but I did want, I do, I did want to love on you. I don't know if that made any sense, but I wanted to love on you. I wanted to, you to know that you are special because you truly are. All right. So let's see what's going on to Zay. All right. All right. So today is a day of breakthrough. All right. Hmm. <laughs> okay. All right. I feel like with all this good energy around you, all this good energy that is being offered to us, okay, we have no choice but to break through those boundaries, people, places, and things, or limiting beliefs have set for us. And I feel like this is just a continuance of breaking through some patterns, completing some cycles, and freeing yourself. Do you see how burdened this person is? Do you see like that? You know, do you see them, you know, but guess what? They they had their gloves on. They fought the good fight. So someone needs to know that that everything that you've been doing concerning yourself has is definitely paying off. These seeds you are planting are going to reap bountiful when the time comes. I want to let you know that. OK, all this fighting, all this fighting for yourself and to be your authentic self. And maybe it hurt with letting some things go and shedding. And maybe you fell apart to build yourself back up. But I promise you, OK, what is going on right now? Okay, it's well worth it. It will be well worth it. Because I truly feel like you're going to be receptive, okay? Once you break through, once you just finally just thrust through that final thing, you know what that thing is, all right? And I feel like today you're definitely going to come out of some comfort zone, some way of thinking, some way of being and just really breaking through and being okay, with what's best for you. And when you do that, you're going to be able to receive. You see how these hands are just extended open wide, like in a just ready, not even a surrender mode, but just ready, just open, willing. 
all right? And I feel like this is going to take away whatever this stress is, okay? Whatever this stress is that you've been going through. You know, it's, it's a lot. You see this clown? <laughs> like they're juggling candles, okay, on bloom bubbles. And, the, you know, the monkey has a needle about to pop it, you know, playing a horn. Just just overworking yourself, over overthinking a situation. But I feel like when you break through, when you make the decision to say, you know what, I surrender and let the will of the universe come. Release it. Breathe in. I And Louise Hay is going to talk about it in this video below. She said that, you know, when things get hectic, when it just gets stressful, when it just gets overwhelming, when anxiety comes on, you really don't know what to do in that moment. Simply breathe in and then breathe out. So we're going to do it together, all right? We're going to... And she say you do that three times and on the third times tell yourself that you say your name and I'm going to say Latoria, all is well and we are safe. And when you do that, it's just going to feel so much lighter. That's you surrendering it to the universe, surrendering it to God, surrendering it to the divine, surrendering it to Kion, whatever it is you believe in. Just surrendering that stress, letting go of that control. That is going to open doors. Open a newness, a freshness around you. Because I feel like when you decide to just not stress it around, you don't have to do anything with it. You just let this situation be. All right. This is when you're going to and let go of the control. All right. Um, this is when you're going to find harmony. Because with every ending, with every release, it's an opportunity for something new to come in. Okay. And I feel like what you're going to allow in when you let go of that stress is harmony. And when you release the control, you're going to allow healing to the situation. All right. Maybe sometime it isn't about the answer, okay? Maybe you're not going to have that answer today. But what I can tell you to do is if you focus on yourself, if you focus on just loving yourself, if you focus on just finding an alignment with you and the divine, I know for sure, this I know for sure, it will work itself out. All right, and maybe I feel like that's the message for someone today. Just break through, set an intent that you know what I, I can't keep dealing with this. this is, uh. <laughs> All right, I feel that energy. But listen, when you surrender, when you break through, you see how both of their hands are up. Do you see that fight? When you break through. When you just allow yourself to be in whatever you are in, all right, in this moment, finding the beauty in this moment, all right, the time is now. Showtime, <laughs> all right, and when you do that, there's just this calmness, there's just this sense of peace, and you know what I'm talking about that comes with that, all right, and that is available for you today okay and with that the healing will happen that you've been wanting okay i feel as though whatever has been um we have flowering to me this is just flourishing all right this is you just flourishing okay i know it's flowering but i love the word flourishing because i feel like that's where where you are right now just you just opening up you just coming into this whole new state of being and seeing you know that's what i truly feel you connecting with source aligning with source in your and your true north and your higher self and everything that's of your highest good that is what you are focusing on right now in this moment today <laughs> So I love you so much, my love muffins. I am going to go be with my family and probably have some tea before um, I send the kids off because I have to make them hot cocoa today because it's getting cold where we are. It's like, yay, winter. So they all want me to make them hot cocoa before they go to school. So I'm going to go do that and just probably pick on them, you know, and love on them <laughs> and be the cool hip mean aunt that i am <laughs> all right so i love you guys so much go out and be great hug a tree for you and me and i will catch you on my channel take care bye